Hello, my name is Eric Patterson, and I'm going to discuss the disposition uh, and what they mean to me. Uh, me personally, I'm th the dispositions I feel are relatable to me because I'm actually in the classroom now. And actually being able to use them all in classroom settings shows me how important they are to my teaching. First, I would like to start with diversity because I, I have worked in many diverse situations with many different ethnicities and cultures over my time of working with children, which I feel makes me very diverse. I have also worked with many different uh, school sets, such as urban and inner city, which I feel contribute to me being diverse as well. Next, I'll uh, discuss professional conduct. I feel this is also something I find very important because this is how coworkers and children who you work with view you. The way you carry yourself says a lot about yourself and you as a person. So in order to be looked at as a professional, you must act as one. And if you want to be truly looked at as professional, you must carry yourself as that, in my opinion. Curiosity is another one that I feel stands out because you must be curious to learn about your students and what helps them grow and what they respond to. You must also be curious to try new things to see how they may turn out for you. So this may be activities in class, projects in class, but you must be curious to see what these activities may bring out of the students or you as a teacher. Honesty. Honesty, I feel this is important because honesty goes a long way for me and being honest shows so much about you, your character, and how you are as a person. So. If you're honest with your students, if you're honest with people that you come in contact with, they'll relate that back to you. So they'll always be honest with you. So if you want honesty out of others, you must bring honesty to the table. And I feel that's why that disposition is so important to me. Another one that's important is compassion. Compassion is also big to me because you must be passionate about working with children or anything that you do in life. And especially with working with children, you must be passionate about their success. If you do not believe in them and build them up with passion and encouragement, where will they get it from? Where will they get that passion from to want to learn, to want to do better? Another disposition that is important to me is dedication. This disposition is important to me because it shows how much things really mean to you as a person, as a teacher. Your dedication to a student's learning shows what kind of teacher you really are. And your dedication in your lessons shows how much you're dedicated to making sure students understand and how much they actually are going to learn. Your ded dedication goes a long way than most people understand. Another disposition that stands out to me is high expectation. You show what level you want your students to reach and what bar you're setting them to reach and you're pushing them to get there. High expectations aren't meant to uh, just truly knock a student down, but they're meant to challenge a student, but it should be a challenge that they should be able to obtain. In order for students to work for something, you must set obtainable expectations for them to be successful. Um, another disposition, and finally, this will be the last one, is fairness. You must be fair to all students and everyone in life. No one should ever be held to a higher standard than the next person. Everyone should be treated equally especially in the classroom, because this helps build character. This helps build them as a person. If someone feels left out and out of place, they'll begin to feel like they have nobody. They'll be able to feel like they're going to just slip through the cracks and they'll be just starting to drift off and not even be that person that they want to be because they feel like they're not being treated fair. So that's why you would like to treat anyone that you come in contact with in life and also in your classroom fair because there should be no one left behind, no students left behind. And those are all the dispositions and what they mean to me. Thank you.